Hey everyone, Matt here from Grit, and what you just saw was an example of what's called a phishing attack, and it's becoming increasingly more of a threat to every business every year, as it can deliver a dangerous blow to your organization, one that will stop you from accessing or working on any type of file and that's called ransomware. Email security filters really only do so much to protect your sensitive information as the tactics and content uh, that these cyber thieves use changes constantly and cybercrime is really big money. On average last year alone, industry experts reported that uh, the average ransom that businesses had to pay was somewhere around $5,600 with an average downtime for a company of about 270,000. So how do bad guys even get ransomware into your network? Well, that's what we're going to cover in today's video, and I'm going to give you five ways that you can help protect yourself from ransom attacks. So the number one way an attacker gets ransomware into your network is through a phishing email in which the bad guy sends an innocent looking email to your employees, you know, asking them to click on a link or download an attachment. These links and attachments contain the malware that infects your computer with ransomware and scrambles the files. Now, it used to be really easy to spot these fraudulent emails in the past. Nowadays, criminals uh, and hackers have become much more sophisticated in their tactics by creating well-crafted emails that can impersonate someone you work with like a CEO, uh, an HR department, uh, or a company you're familiar with like Microsoft, Facebook, and it's gonna create a sense of urgency on your part to interact and click. So in the case of our intro video that you saw, the idea that you need to quickly download this form is exactly what these attackers are looking for. They want your employees to quickly click and interact with the email and get ransomware into your network. So what's the good news in all of this? Well, the good news is, is that there are things you can do to fight back and we're gonna give you five ways to start doing that. So let's start with number one. The first one is, and probably one of the easiest, is, is actually hover your mouse cursor over any links or an email of someone that you don't know or an email you were expecting. So so often criminals will actually trick recipients by including the name of a legitimate company within the structure of the email and even providing a web link. So if you only glance at these details, they can look very real. But if you take a moment to actually examine the email address, you may find that this is bogus variation intended to appear authentic. Before clicking on any links, make sure that it's from someone you know and trust and hover over and inspect each one first. So this brings us to number two. So if your business is already in Office 365, then one feature you can deploy is have any email from outside of your organization display an external sender message at the top of the email. This is extremely helpful as this can help identify potential phishing emails that are coming in and attempting to impersonate someone on your staff, like a CEO of a company, for example. Now, at first glance, this email might look legitimate. However, if this external banner shows up on an email that looks like it's from someone inside of your company, you can be sure that this email is from outside of your organization and potentially harmful because if it were with someone inside of your organization, then the banner wouldn't even show up. Now that's not only cool, but it's something that's free and part of Office 365 and can help your company immensely. So let's go on to number three. And number three is enroll your staff into a cybersecurity training program. So training alone is a great idea to help your staff understand these threats. You need a training program that keeps those skills sharp with periodic simulated phishing emails to ensure that they're carefully looking for the red flags that would identify an email as a phishing attack. This type of training helps you identify those individuals that are gonna be interacting with these types of emails and just helps you give them better training. Cyber thieves are relying on the fact that your employees are the greatest opportunity to get what they want, which makes them the biggest risk when it comes to securing your environment. With that, that brings us to number four, which is find yourself a managed service provider that makes cybersecurity a priority. Our clients here at GRIT that are enrolled in our basic security support program get the benefits of cybersecurity training and proactive simulated phishing campaigns that we manage for them. Our account management team provides these clients with updated results and keeps clients up to date with the latest threats to their organization, giving them another layer of protection and a plan that they can easily follow. So this brings us to number five on our list, and that is to review your backup strategy. Sometimes even with the proactive solutions that we just covered, you can still get ransomware into your organization. As I mentioned earlier, all it takes is one click. If this happens, one of the best ways to get a business back up and running is to recover from a backup created before the infection happened. However, new versions of ransomware are infecting local and cloud backup systems, making it exceedingly difficult for businesses to get back up and running quickly or really even at all. So what do you do? Well, one recommendation that we give to our clients is a product called Datto. Datto Cirrus monitors and targets specific patterns of ransomware with every backup. It notifies you and helps you get right back to business without having to pay the ransom. All backups are scanned for ransomware, they're validated, and ensure they're clean and available for the restore. 
With the solution in place, you essentially can turn back the clock to a snapshot taken before the attack happened and get back up and running quickly. We covered Datto in another video, so make sure to check that video out. We'll also make sure to provide a link in the description below. So there you go. Five ways to help protect your organization from phishing and ransomware. Now, if you have any questions or you would like to know more, feel free to reach out to us at grittext.com. Leave us a comment and I will see you in the next video.